Welcome to watch the BYD Battery Box Premium HVL Installation Guide video. This video includes the following content. Requirements, installation, wiring connection, commissioning. All product documents can be downloaded from the BYD Battery Box official website, including data sheets, technical information, service guidelines, and operating manuals, among others. Please be aware, the following tools could be used during the installation. Installers must wear safety shoes and insulating gloves to ensure safety. The installation environment must be well ventilated and far away from fire and combustibles. The working temperature must be controlled at negative 10 degrees Celsius to 50 degrees Celsius, and humidity should be kept at 5% to 95%. This is an HVL system consisting of one BCU and four battery modules. Unpack the package and take out the modules and accessories carefully. Quick installation guide manual, a pair of hangers, and four M5 screws can be found in the BCU package. Remove the bolts between the BCU and base. Take the BCU from the base. The base should be placed along the wall and keep 12 to 19 millimeters from the wall. Put one battery module on the base. The blind mating connectors of the battery module and base should be on the same side. Repeat the steps for installing additional modules. Install the hangers on the BCU and tighten the M5 screws by using a screwdriver. Torque, 5.5 Newton meters. Put the BCU on top of the battery modules. Hold the hangers where they intend to be mounted on the wall and mark the position of the drill holes. Take the BCU from the battery system and drill the marked holes. Insert screws and anchors into the drill holes if the support surface requires them. Put the BCU back on top of the battery system. Tighten the screws between each of the modules. Torque 2 Newton meters. Secure the hanger using screws. Recommended M8 by 40. Mark the product type on the nameplate. Make sure that the state of the air switch is off. Then unscrew all the bolts on the cover and remove the cover. There are three holes on the left side of the cable management box. The top hole is for the communication cable, the middle one is for the ethernet cable, and the bottom is for the ground cable and power cables. The figure shows the internal wiring panel of the BCU. This information can be found in the quick start manual. Remove the nuts on the wire holes. Pass the PE and DC cables through the first metal pipe. And the communication cable and the ethernet cable pass through the other two metal pipes. Then fix the three metal pipes. Fix and tighten the PE conductor. Torque 4 Newton meters. Regarding wire diameter requirements, please check your inverter operating manual. During wiring, the opposite end of the power cables must be insulated. Push the terminal level up and insert each conductor into the corresponding terminal point. Pull the terminal lever down. BYD Battery Box is capable of connecting inverters with different options. Please be reminded to choose a suitable one. All inverter brands wiring options can be found in the Quick Start Guide. Please plug the network cable into the corresponding RJ45 port to make sure the system can connect to the internet, if the system is intended to connect to the internet. Fix the side cover. Use a Phillips screwdriver and tighten it. Make sure the screws are fixed well. Failure to do so will make any manufacturer's warranty, guarantee, or liability null and void. The 
the number of HVL modules connected in series is limited to 3 to 8. Please turn on the system in the correct order below. Switch on the air switch between the battery and the inverter. Open the plastic cover on the right side of the BCU and then push up the air switch. Switch the inverter on. The LED will start to flash, half second white, half second blue. Then it turns to flash white once and blue three or 11 times. The blue LED will disappear after working with the inverter. In general, the white LED indicates the system is normal, and the blue LED indicates low SOC or malfunction. For more details, please refer to the operating manual. Download B Connect from the Google Play or App Store. Authorize B Connect. Click Start, then the firmware files will be downloaded automatically. Click to Wi-Fi settings. Connect the YLAN of the battery system. Password BYDB hyphen box. Please turn off the cellular data and disconnect the ethernet cable at the router side, which will be better for the YLAN connection between the battery system and your device. Back to B Connect. Then the firmware will be updated automatically. On the configuration page, click next to set time. Choose an inverter brand. Then, next, choose the battery system model, and then set the installed module numbers of each tower. Choose the grid and phase options according to the actual application. Check the summary of the configuration information. Tick the sentence and click Next. Click OK. Then you will see the information of the battery system. The procedure to switch off the battery system is 1. Switch off the inverter. 2. Switch off the battery. 3. Switch off the air switch between battery and inverter, if any. The correct way to switch off the battery system is to press the LED button until the air switch turns off, about 5 seconds. If two or three battery systems are connected in parallel, turn off the LED button on the master system. The slave systems will be turned off automatically. The following is the contact information of your local BYD official service partner. If you have any questions during or after the installation process, please feel free to contact us for help. Thank you for choosing BYD Battery Box Premium.